Hey guys, what is up? And welcome to Day to Day with Ray. With me, your girl Ray Ray. I feel like, well, I know it's been forever since I made a video. I've just been so busy with life. It's ridiculous. Does this zoom out anymore or am I? Okay. Um, I have a snow day today. Look outside at all the wonderful, wonderful snow. So it is snowing today and it's actually getting ready to switch over to stupid rain and ice. It just stopped snowing a little while ago. So I said, while I have the opportunity, I am going to make one of my favorite treats when it snows and it is snow ice cream. And I'm sure everybody has made this before. I used to make it with my son all the time, every time it snowed, but Maryland weather is crazy because today we have snow, we have ice, and tomorrow is gonna be 60 degrees, almost 60. So I just printed out a referral, like a reference paper, cause I know how to make it, but this way I can put the um, actual recipe and the actual measurements and stuff um, in the description below. Now this recipe calls for eight cups of snow. I'm only making half the recipe. So I am going to get a bowl. So let me get my bowl really quick. Okay, so I have my bowl. I'm just gonna use this glass bowl. And you have to work really, really quickly with this recipe because once you bring the snow inside, the snow, duh, of course, melts. So I'm gonna get all my other ingredients together and ready so as soon as I come in with the bowl of snow, we'll be ready to go. So I'm gonna get everything together and show you what we need. Okay, so I have all my ingredients already ready to go. The first ingredient that you will need, now you can use the recipe says, one third cup of granulated sugar. I am not using granulated sugar. I am using granulated, no calorie, sugar-free um, sweetener to taste like sugar. Um, and instead of a third cup, because I'm only getting four cups of snow, instead of eight cups of snow, I have two and a half tablespoons uh in this bowl ready to go um i'm still gonna put in my vanilla and you just need a pinch of salt and then instead of one cup of milk i'm going to do a half a cup of milk and then to top it off put some sprinkles in it make it all colorful and fun you could put chocolate syrup on top of it all that fun stuff so now i'm gonna go out in the snow and get four cups of sugar i mean four cups of sugar four cups of snow with the snow oh, we got the snow okay Ooh. so we have our snow we have to work fast we have not been outside yet today so the snow all around my front step was um, nice and fresh so I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna pour my milk in and stir this up quickly I'm flinging I did put a little extra snow in because of this mess it's not the easiest stuff to mix let me tell you so i'm just mixing this up i'm going to add my sugar in and keep mixing it i am making a mess making a mess that's okay. My ca my counters are clean. <laughs> it's just for me and my son. So, like I said, if you want to make a big batch, this is only half a batch, and it's already a lot. <laughs> so now you just add a pinch of salt. Which is all I did. Mixing it up. 
And then I'm gonna add some vanilla to it. Oh, is this the new one? I thought I had one that's open. This one's clear. Oh my goodness, all right. I'm just gonna add a capful, put that in there, put this back on. Thank you, Kara, for the vanilla. Just kind of mix this up really, really good. And there you go. There is your snow cream. Like I said, it melts like super fast. Now that you have like your milk and your sugar and now to make it fun i'm gonna actually don't i have an ice cream scoop i could scoop it in little i'm just gonna put some in this bowl this is what my sugar was in put it in like that Put some, put some sprinkles. Oh my gosh, that's so much fun. And then we're gonna add a few drizzles, just a few of chocolate syrup. And there is our fun, snow day treats of snow ice cream.